In this video, I'm going to talk about CoinManage 2023. We've just released it. One of the things we spent a lot of time on for the new version is adding values for modern coins, such as silver eagles, as you see here, uh, modern commemoratives, uh, presidential dollars, etc., etc. And um, so you see a lot more values for higher grades, such as MS68, 69, PRDC, etc. We also have two new sections in the view by view of the main window. One is the CAC verified section. So once you click on this, all the CAC verified coins will show up. And another one is we now have purchases by year, which seems to be better than purchases by month, which can be a bit confusing, I think. So now purchases by year, you just click on the year and you can see all your coin purchases for that particular year. Another feature we've added is very helpful if you know the PCGS number of the coin you're about to inventory. And this feature works on any listed coins such as you see in the collection view behind here or in the add coin dialog which I'm in now. So what I'm going to do is I'll, collect the, I'll click on the United States and now if I type in P followed by the PCGS number, so I'm going to type in First of all, make sure you click within the list to make it active. So I'll type in P6851. And you can see here that it's found this particular coin, which is uh, which has the PCGS number 6851. And I click OK. You can see it's a 1794 flowing hair $1. And the PCGS number is 6851. Now some PCGS numbers are five or six digits and that can be kind of hard, hard to type in, especially if you're not a typer and you only have a, a set amount of time to type in uh, something to search for in a list. So let's say I'm in AdCoin dialog and I have a list of PCGS numbers right here in a notepad and I'm going to select one, right mouse click, click copy. Now what I can do by the way, you don't have to click on the entire United States. If you know what kind of coin it is, for example, I know this is a um, Silver Eagles, so I'm just going to select Bullion Coins, Silver Eagles. Click in there as always to make it active. Now that I have, I've placed the PCGS number on the clipboard by selecting Copy. Now if I just type in CP, it's going to go to that coin. So let's say I have it in MS69, click OK. You can see here is the coin that PCGS number. 